countries. So, uh, in the, as part of this basis training, basis and HANA administration training, so what we are going to discuss and uh, when we are going to complete this one, timelines, we will, we will, we will decide the timelines and uh, what I'm going to provide the access parts and everything. Okay, we'll discuss that one as part of the so demo class. So it's kind of demo. So you can see here, this is kind of the demo class. That's why I mentioned the heading as a demo. Okay, so demo means, so we'll discuss about the SAP and HANA administration, the topics. So in detail, the topics, what topics we are going to discover. And first of all, what is SAP? Here, anybody aware of what is SAP? In the group, so SAP. Anybody aware of what is SAP? Here, and there, it's an ERP, one of the ERP among many other ERPs. It is systems, applications, and products. It is German-based company and software. Right, exactly. So SAP is the application, one of the application which is one of the ERP product, okay? So this is one of the ERP product, as uh, Suman mentioned, thank you, Suman. So uh, it's one of the ERP product. Suman, right? Yeah, Ravinder. Okay, good, good, thank you. Yeah, so it's derived from the, the ERP, Enterprise Resource Planning. So SAP is, we have the, in the market, we have many applications. In the market, we have, many applications in that SAP is the one of the application. It's the like German product. Why? Because it's developed by, it's released by German people in 1972, they are releasing this one. So that detailed discussion we will discuss in the, our regular classes. Okay. The versions, history. So who five IBM, five service people, German product, they all developed. SAP. So normally SAP, they will use in the all the business scenarios, all the business scenarios. Suppose if I talk about the, so our SAP architecture, this is the presentation layer. So this SAP is the three-tier architecture. So SAP is the three-tier architecture. So this is the presentation layer. Presentation layer means we are here, means SAP GUI, our browser, through browsers we will log in to SAP. We will connect it to the SAP. SAP is the application, it's application layer, right? The next one is the DB layer. Each application, one layer is called the DB layer. One, one DB is required. So that, that, that is the DB so layer, that is the DB, okay? So here, here, so normally every user, so they will they will log in from their browsers, their GUI, their front end missions, and they will connect to the SAP. And the SAP they will do the so business. That business data, everything will go to the database level, it will store it. So as part of our training, the first we will discuss about the SAP. Then we will go with the DB administration. So first SAP administration, then database administration. So in the DB SAP administration, so what we are going to cover is in SAP administration, we are going to discuss about the SAP installations, right? So we will get the installation, right? Because installation activity is purely basis team has to perform, right? So post installation activities, then uh, other topics like we have the in SAP, we have the work process and the client copies, and transports and operational modes. So like that, all the topics one by one, one by one, we will discuss it. So maximum 12 or 13 topics are there. Along with the major topics like kernel upgrades, SAP, SP upgrade, SPS upgrades. So normally yeah, they, will, they will tell like spam saying, but here we are going, we will discuss about the using the sum tool. Using the sum tool, we will perform the upgrade here. So in the real time also all people they will use the real time and everything so and also some real time scenarios real time uh, this cell this will happen every day the real time scenarios the interview point of time in each and every topic when we, when we are discussing about the one topic 
we will discuss about the actual that uh, what is the main the topic and interview point of time how the questions will will come in that topic and uh, real time how we will get the requests from the the users customers and everything so this type of discussing everything we will discuss and uh, yes and kernel upgrades and also upgrade parts and the maintenance activities also we will not only small level activities high level activities also we will discuss in our classes and system copy system copy and refresh db refresh related activities also we will discuss in the our regular classes coming to the so db side db we are going to discuss about the ana db ana 2.0 latest versions then ana installations ana installations ana upgrades ana installations ana upgrades and 1.0 to 2.0 conversion so how to upgrade from one this is one of the frequent question how to how to move from 1.0 to 2.0 so then stop and start and ana administration ana cockpit ana cockpit ana cockpit 2.0 then ana ha and high availability the dr related information then replication modes ana cluster so sorry uh, cluster ana clusters takeovers so backups so backups restore refresh so all these things we will cover in the our hana administration these all topics are very high level topics which are required for the basic team we will cover everything here and also basic side we will cover simply say whatever the basis consultant required we will discuss everything here up to 12 up to 13 14 15 years person required zero to so everything we will cover everything we will cover in the so as part of the for regular courses okay these are the coming to the topics and administrations so maybe if i missed one or two maybe we can include, include that one also i will also send the course content to you in the group so that is fine so any questions from anyone here so upgrades means we can see here how uh, our people are doing the upgrade so they are doing the upgrade one of the production system in the landscape they are doing the upgrade using the ecc ecc uh, system upgrade they are doing it using the latest versions they are doing the upgrade so in the back end they are doing the shadow system creations everything they are doing actually so this is the our server look like the server access also we will provide to that one so that you will get the voice level access and the sap systems then everything you can log in this is this other looks like the sap screens looks like this one so you, you can install it so you, you have to install the sap systems so we have to add the entries into the sap logon pad this is our voice access and also i will provide the access to the putty level so you can log into the our putty systems our systems then from there you can access our servers there you can access our servers and everything you can access it. so to install the hana db and everything you can access it. so you will get a wider access wider access means full access you will get so if you want to install delete whatever you want to do you will get the access wise so people will log in and they will do the practice here okay so this is the access part you will get so and studio ana studio ana administration all these things you will get the access studio x also you have so ana studio studio x also you have you will get the access to the studio as well so this is the way you will get the access studio putty putty means linux administrations we will also discuss about the linux administration as well so for hana you required the some linux knowledge you required some basic commands you required so the people who don't know linux knowledge we will discuss about the linux administration as well we will also discuss about the linux administration okay then sap ana installation how to do then backups restore recover everything will be useful in the so real time and sap applications we will discuss about so all these things we will discuss in our regular classes okay so coming to the duration so maybe what i am thinking maybe it's 50 to 55 days it will take 50 to 55 days it will take so it starts from monday to maybe today we can take it monday to every saturday up to saturday sunday holiday 
and access part you can access any any time so any time you can access it why because it's a public public uh, uh, ip i have so that you will get the remote server access then you can log into the remote server either through mobile or so you can any device you can log in and you can access the my server so to practice it so the classes starts from monday to saturday so and uh, the timings 6 to 7 this is the current timings for this week this week one batch is going to complete the 7 to 8 batch once that is completed then you guys can jump into the 7 to 8 batch that is also fine or if you are okay with this batch we will continue with this 6 to 7 8 am batch from now so this is the timelines i hope this timelines are okay for everyone right any any questions or concerns regarding the timelines Sir, is it possible at the evening? Evening, uh, no, Sanjay. Evening, so I have work actually. Evening possible. Even uh, I did not get time to work on my work even. Even even was not possible for me even was. I have slots like so. Okay, let's discuss end of the this one. And uh, yeah, these are the timings. any 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 questions concerns on the so topics i will share the content can go through if you want to add anything we can add, we can add it if you want to re, uh, that, that the thing operational modes tcm everything we will discuss whatever the basic concerns right all this we will discuss it's a real time so every saturday so every saturday we have every saturday in the whatever the that week we discussed on monday to friday that will be discussed as a group group discussion in the form of group discussion some assessments some interview points some interviews mock interviews that everything will be covered in the every saturday in saturday class so saturday class is dedicated to for the our weekly review weekly review of the classes so every week we will review the how you are like are you practicing or not practicing where you are so if you need a topic to be revised everything so that that will be weekly review happen in the so every saturday class which means some mock interviews will be conducted so and also some uh, group discussions so and revising the previous topics so an interview point of time in the real time all will be discussed in the every saturday's class so that in this way you will be in the sync so if not only i'm not only keeping on discussing with the topic but i will also ask a question from the everyday classes as well so saturday like we will dedicatedly so put like weekly review class so that every person should participate and we should uh, so we should interview what, where you are and what skills and are you are you up to the speed or not that we will discuss only so every saturday so that is the timelines so that is the discussion yeah and uh, yeah these are the topics which we are going to cover and uh, at the end of the classes after the one basis and hana completed we will have the important points we will discuss interview point of time important questions we will discuss how the it will be helpful in the interviews in the real times and everything that any ho that kind of revisions recapping activity recap recapping of the previous previous topics all the topics we will take it one topic we will take it and each topic how the interview questions may get and how the interview will ask and also how it will be helpful for the real time so all these things will be happen in the after the end of the course that is the uh, agenda agenda of the course so if i talk about the sap is the application and also we have the database which will depend on the database so sap will depend on the database without database sap will not live so it's bit stopped status so first we will discuss about the sap application then followed by the database administration so that is the three two courses we are going to cover sap basis and ana administrations so two courses we are going to cover in the in this administration part okay so this is the the main aim so and also in the time permits for us in this batch i am going to add some additional topics like some java administration the time permits definitely like i will discuss about the java administration as well why because few of the interviews few of the 
people requested to take the java administration classes also so that i will take java administration class also so okay that that way you will be on the same way not only above not only java so in the real time with us we have java systems also will be available that we will not the coding part java is sap java is a separate that we will discuss with us we are the, our role is the sap basis consultant our role is the sap basis consultant with us so we have the functional so security so developers so all all people will work with us and the users everything so we are the main in the team sap basis consultant so we are the our role is sap basis consultant main role with us everyone will work right so we are the main administrator for the company without us without without basis team so no one cannot start the system so no one know how to troubleshoot the issues and everything how to upgrade the system and everything so we are the main team in the organization okay so this is the so but detailed discussion will come will be come in the maybe uh, our first class onwards so this this is about the so to sync up with everyone what we are going to discuss and the timelines so i i arranged this session so if anyone wants to any questions or doubts so just you can bring up now uh, 